Hi everyone, Chris here from techtablet.com. I've had uh, some comments on how do we install just the Windows operating system on a dual boot Chinese tablet like the X98 Air 3G. Well, it's actually quite easy to do. Uh, in this video, I'll show you what you need to do. So, in my other tutorial video, which there's a link of in the description of this video, I showed you how to make a bootable USB flash drive. Well, I have it right here, a GPT partitioned drive. So that will boot. And I have my mouse connected. And the important thing here is to make sure that you have your flash drive with Windows on it on the first hub port. I don't think it'll work on another port. I've, I've noticed that if I try and boot directly to it on another port on the hub, it will just flash and will not let me boot. So we just need to power on the tablet. And hit enter. Uh, sorry, escape. Escape to get into the BIOS. So once you're in the BIOS, it's just a matter of going to the save and exit menu, finding the memory card that you have inserted in your hub. My one here is this Patriot memory. So all I need to do is just select that and the system will now start to boot into the Windows install. So this drive now should be flashing. You can see now it's just starting to flash so the Windows install is starting to load. And what needs to be done now is just to remove all the Android partitions and install Windows over the top, completely taking up the whole drive space of the of the 32 gigabyte eMMC. So you have the Windows install screen here. Just need to click next on that. Install now. This will take about a minute. I will just cut this out of the video. So this screen here will eventually load up. Just need to accept it and click next. And we need to go to a custom install, which is just the menu below. And you'll see here we have all the partitions of Android are all listed here. So you just need to go and select each one of them and delete them. So go down through the list of all of them, delete all of them. There are quite a few partitions there that Android makes, so you've got to go through and delete all of those. And when you finally have leftover space, I think of around about 28 gigabytes, you can install Windows on that. So you just have Windows on there. And all you need to do is click next and start the Windows install. Now I have another video, my tutorial video, which actually covers the installation of Windows, the drivers, setting the system up. There's a link to that in the description of this video. So if you do need help with the Windows installation, setup and everything like that, that video should uh, help you. Okay, so once you've done all of that, uh, I'll show you how to remove the dual boot BIOS and make it so it only boots to Windows and doesn't display the dual boot screen. Just going to power the system off now. So you've done your Windows install and you want to get rid of the dual boot menu. Just need to power it on, holding up the volume up button. and you'll be presented with the dual boot menu. So the way to make this option stay and stick is up here at the top. You'll see that there is a, a little box there you can untick. This is basically the dual boot menu. So you click that and you can make the, basically make it stick the setting that we will always boot into Windows. So what you need to do then is just hit start and you will always boot into Windows. Now if you wanted to have boot into Android later, 
you can't because you've deleted all the partitions. So you need to look at my other tutorial about flashing Android again and bringing the tablet back to square one. Okay, so that's how you install Windows on a dual boot, boot tablet. Just Windows alone and no Android. This video was helpful. Please give me a thumbs up and please do subscribe to my channel. I have more upcoming videos on various tablets from China. Thanks for watching.